Here's a summary of extrapyramidal symptoms, which are side effects to antipsychotic medications, as well as the treatments to these side effects. They're going to go in order from the most acute to the most chronic and severe. Let's start with acute dystonia, which is a sudden sustained contraction of the neck, mouth, tongue, and eye muscles. The treatment for this is benztropine or diphenhydramine, which is Benadryl. Next is akathisia. This is a subjective restlessness or an inability to sit still, kind of like restless leg syndrome. The treatment here are many beta blockers like propanolol, benzodiazepines like lorazepam, or benztropine. We'll see that benztropine fixes the first three of these. The next is Parkinsonism. It's a gradual onset tremor, rigidity, and bradykinesia, just like in Parkinson's disease. The treatment here is benztropine or amantadine. Lastly, and the most chronic long-term consequence of using antipsychotic medications is tardive dyskinesia. This is a gradual onset after prolonged therapy, at least six months of antipsychotics, and it's a dyskinesia of the mouth, face, trunk, and extremities. The treatment here is different. There's no benztropine, there's valbenazine, and do tetrabenazine.